Check out this new drill. Some may be, some of it may seem old, some of it may seem new. You're, everyone's familiar with the single alao choy, but through inspiration from my son, have you thought about the double or the triple alao choy? Okay, we're doing the single alao choy that many of you are quite familiar with. Check out the double alao choy drill. Yeah. <laughs> Ultimate, a triple alao choy. Okay. Let's go for it. So we've already learned the three, the triple ala choy, ala choy, ala choy. But Sifu Fog has always taught us to steal the ride. Those were his terms, to steal the ride. And I'm going to show you how to train that in this steal the ride drill off a of triple ala. Getting older, but I think this is a mantis, uh, this technique here. Mantis uh, uh, peeps out of the cave or seeks pearls or something like that. You can do it like this and then just go for it. So this actual technique should not be just here, but I'm actually using this to strike and distract. Then I can trap, and then it gives me a direct line to get, seek his pearls, grab right underneath. Here's some other examples of catching the rod with the back fist. But not this way. Because... 14 roads, number two, pop, trap, palm, bumbo, pop, pop. Okay, so we're going to do the simbo, uh, but for beginners, they'll probably just be just arms up, fist, and then someone will say change, change directions, and then change, change directions, change, change. Okay. And the key to the changing is when you're here and you're changing, you have to make sure you block your groin and turn back around. So you're covering your groin, protecting it, change, protecting the groin as you open up and then close back in. And then from here, then we go to the simbo. So we've gone from a long distance to medium distance. And then we make contact. go into the next technique. We're creating the infrastructure on how to build the student's uh, fighting skills. So the infrastructure all starts with this simple symbol because this is the building block, but then each one has learned an alphabet. And so, but you have to give them specifics of, okay, you learn millstone palm today. So go ahead and do millstone palm on your partner. And then your partner then will do the, the same. For that, then you're building on two techniques, three techniques. So example of building up to then two techniques uh, and giving instruction as well as opposed to free flow yet, is just um, here. So we're gonna do millstone palm and then waist chop. <laughs> You're welcome. That was awesome. <laughs>